If you are familiar with the whole wizard tool, you might be aware of a 3D sketch option that allows you to place multiple holes on non-planar surfaces. Moving on to the assembly, you might need to insert a common component into each of these holes. At this point, it might make sense to use the sketch-driven pattern and select the 3D sketch from the whole wizard feature. But there's a problem. The patterned components line up in the same direction as the seed component, instead of being perpendicular to the surface. A way of getting around this is to use the pattern-driven component feature. At this point, you might be asking why we should be using this, since we did not create any pattern feature. Well, interestingly, the pattern-driven component feature actually recognizes a whole wizard feature as a driving feature. Select the whole wizard feature from the assembly tree and this creates a pattern where the components are oriented in the desired manner. <laughs> 